And let me break this down for you. Let me show the hail sizes and what the different uh, hail sizes means as far as damage go. And when you take a look at the, the dime to nickel size stuff, that really doesn't do any damage. It makes for some good tweets when you send them to me, and I certainly appreciate that. But when you go up in size, you get to the quarters, the half dollars, maybe even the ping pong ball size hail, that's when damage begins. And when you have hail one inch in diameter or larger, that's the definition of severe hail. Below one inch, it's not severe. It's pretty pictures, but one inch and above, you certainly have severe hail. Then you get up to the golf ball, the egg, the tennis ball size hail. That's when you have dents in cars, breaks in windows, roofs and siding are damaged. You go up in size from there, two and three quarter inches up to three quarters, well, up to three inches. That's the baseball. That's also the hockey puck size hail. It's the branches that are broken off of trees. It's the, the bark, the windshields that are smashed. And then you get to the real big stuff, the four, four and a half inch. Take a look at the grapefruit, the softball size hail. That's what we had two years ago in Washington. And that's when we have significant damage there. None of that's in our forecast, but it's the beginning of spring severe weather season. I hope it's not, but you know the story in Texas. We always have large hail. Hopefully we won't this year, but we'll keep an eye on it.